What's up? Welcome. Welcome back to I Dan TV. Thank you for riding with your boy Doobie. Another episode. I'm struggles to see life. Episode two here. We're going into it on the males. As I said in episode one, which is kind of raw, but just when you hear about the males, are you satisfied with your status? Take a look around you. Look at what's going on in the world right now. Let's think about it. If according to his story, males have been real prevalent in a lot of things that goes on in this world. Now, according to his story, do we take credit for all of that? Do we take credit for the destruction as well as the glorify the accomplishment? Let's really think about the status that we're at right now. Are you satisfied with that? As a male, are you satisfied as a whole? Are you satisfied as a male in this, this community? I think we're still in a playpen. We are controlled by three hormones, basically. Driven by one emotion. I'll go into those hormones. Come on. Number one would be the anger, destructive, argumentative demeanor and attitude. Not being able to solve a simple issue without logically thinking about it. And that amazes me because it leads to the next hormone, hormonal issue of sexual energy, the sexual energy. From that, now that amazes me that we can get that energy from that because 95% of us do. Now, from that, it leads to hunger. And that hunger needs to be fed with flesh and muscle. And those three hormones are driven by one emotion, and that's ego. We haven't learned to control an ego to get to the other emotions. We're still stuck on that one emotion. I think the reason for that is because we've been detached, not knowing that we are the tools of this universe to repair the infrastructure of the universe, to fill in the potholes of the universe, to protect our families of the universe. That detachment comes from the moment we enter this world. From the moment we've entered this world, we've been told what to do, when to do it, how to do it, where to do it. <laughs> so, we've lost that original touch. And that comes only from the female, and that touch was the nourishment, the reassuring, the loving that gave us confidence and strengthened the ego to make us feel male, to make us want to do the things that we're supposed to do as tools of this universe. Now, since we don't have that, we are not able to graduate from using crayons. From crayons, we don't even know how to graduate to pencils. 
from pencils. We don't even know how to graduate to the pens. And so in that educational system, we're supposed to be graduating from the pens and having a mastermind. Okay, but in that mastermind, I give it credit because even there we should be able to recognize our purpose in this universe, our worth in this universe. The understanding of who we are in this universe. Males, we got to step up. If we have a legacy, let's live it. I'll leave it there. You got to tell me how male are you and are you really satisfied with the status you are in right now? Okay? So, on that note, I'll end it. And I'll end it with a mind fog on this episode. And this mind fog is, we know that there are X chromosomes. We know that there are Y chromosomes. Which was here first? Y'all subscribe, like, comment, share. To the next episode. All right, then.